Positive cases in the valley continue rising with Hidalgo County reporting around 700 cases a day and Cameron County reporting in the hundreds. CBS 4's Karina Vargas spoke to health officials about the comparison in each county and how testing is affecting those numbers. There's less mass testing, in other words, people just getting tested because they wanted to or because they're worried and, and there's more and more people getting tested because they have symptoms. Cameron County Health Authority Dr. James Castillo says around 500 tests are done daily, but the kind of testing that is being done is also playing a major role in their positive cases. There's been over 16,500 tests done in, in, in Cameron County alone. Um, you know, those tests include antigen tests, PCR tests. They also include people getting tested multiple times. With a large difference from Hidalgo to Cameron County, Castillo says more testing is being done in Hidalgo, which would explain their increase. In Cameron, is like one test for every 25 residents, and Hidalgo is like one for every 22. So I think Hidalgo is maybe doing 10% more testing. Dr. Ivan Melendez, Hidalgo County Health Authority, says that while they are seeing a surge in cases and testing is widely available, he adds there can never be too much. Well, we'd still like to have a lot more testing. Um, you can never, I think, over test. So if you're going to do effective contact tracing, testing is of paramount importance. The Texas Department of State Health Services shows the total tests performed throughout the pandemic. And Cameron County stands at 146,000 and Hidalgo at nearly 280,000. Dr. Melendez urging residents to be safe during the holidays and says many of COVID-19 deaths are avoidable. Working for you in Harlingen, I'm Karina Vargas. Dr. Melendez adds the rise in cases is also in part from a backlog in the system.